Hi, it's Kim from Expressions of the Universe, and we're doing a pick your own for the full moon and the equinox change of the seasons. So I'm going to post the picture. You could pick card one through seven. You may have already done that on Facebook or Instagram. Go ahead, pause your screen, take a deep breath, choose your card, and then I'm going to show you the reveal and the reading. Hi, it's Kim from Expressions of the Universe with your Pick Your Own Reveal. So let's get started. The first card is Talents, and it's using the crystal Rhodonite. This speaks to me about our talents that we're not using or they're being squashed have to emerge at this time with the full moon and the change of the season. It's time for you to go within and find out what your talents are because this is going to be your life's purpose. It's time for you to start utilizing your talents, your hidden talents. Card number two is growth and it's represented by adventuring. It's a super healing stone. Of course, it's represented by green. Think of Archangel Raphael, but this is going to be a huge time where you're going to grow and blossom. You're overcoming a lot of adversity from the past, almost as if you were incubating all winter long, and now it's time for you to grow and emerge. Card number three is manifestation, and it's represented by citrine. And this is fantastic because it says that joy, abundance, prosperity, all coming to you at this time. If you've picked this card, these things are just waiting in the wings to come to you, for you to manifest. So get your head in the right mode during this full moon and the change of the seasons so that you can bring in everything you want. Card number four is Child Within, represented by Rhodochrosite. And this is saying... It's time to nurture and heal your inner child, love yourself more, focus on yourself so that you can give that back out to, you know, the rest of the world. It's all about you at this time. You have to find your inner child. I'm wondering if whoever picked car four, if you've been way too serious lately, because now it's time to let that child out and play. Card five is love. So who out there is looking and searching for love and picked card number five? It's represented by Rose Quartz. This doesn't have to be romantic love. This could be also loving yourself, but learning how to love other people, falling deeper in love with an animal, a job, a human, if, if that's the case, but love is coming your way, but you have to open your heart up to that. Card six, and this is the card that I chose. So this was pretty telling, and it's healing, represented by the crystal seraphonite, and that's a green stone. What I found interesting about this, I'm like, really? Because I wanted this card, however, I think we all have a part of us that needs healing on some level. You think that you have healed those things that we, you know, you've stuffed deep down and hidden away and trudged on through life, but there's something there, whether it be physical, mental, or spiritual, something within you has to heal during this time in order for new beginnings to begin. I feel like for those that picked card six, you're still not manifesting what it is that you really want, your passion, because it's being blocked by something that needs to heal. So tonight's full moon is a good time to try and let all that go. And then card seven is purification, represented by black tourmaline. And this is telling me... A need for total body, mind, and spiritual detoxification. 
So something within your realm, whether it be the people you're hanging out with, your lifestyle, your, um, your health, the way you eat, sleep, don't, you know, eat healthy, you're not sleeping enough, maybe you're drinking too much, you know, anything. There's something around you that's got to go. It has to be purified, has to be cleansed out. Spring cleaning for whoever chose this card, whether it be the physical, the mental, or the body, needs to be cleaned out. So I bet there are a lot of people saying, oh, well, that's not what I wanted to hear for this full moon and vernal or autumnal equinox, the change of the season. But those are the cards you chose. I chose these blindly and then I shuffled them up and laid them down. So I didn't even know which one I was picking. And I know that I'm sure there's something within me that needs to be healed. Anyway, Happy full moon blessings. Mm. Happy equinox. Happy first day of spring in the northern hemisphere. Autumn in the southern hemisphere. Thank you for watching. Share this video with your friends so that they can pick a card too. I'll talk to you later. Bye.